Welcome back kids. Today we are going to learn how to make this fish in MS Paint. So let's get started. We are going to use the calligraphy brush over here. So first we have to take the rectangle. Then go to fill and take oil. Now click on color 1 and take this color. Similarly for color 2, draw a big rectangle which is covering your whole screen. Go to now for making fish, go to oval tool. Again, click on the fill color and take solid color. Take orange color or take red color over here. Then go to color 2, take orange color and draw an oval like this. Make sure the size is the last one, right? After this, I'm going to choose the calligraphy brush. You can choose any of them. There are two calligraphy brush. And then uh, just make sure that you have chosen the last size. Try to make the fins of the fish. If you are not satisfied, click on undo. Try to fill the color as well. You can do it later also. Like this. Make the fins over here as well. Okay, then you can make the mouth of the fish as well. And then let me choose this size and I'm going to draw a line like this. Now to make the eyes, I'll take oval tool and take black color in both of color 1 and color 2. Draw a circle. Now let's take the white color in color 1 and color 2 and draw inside the black circle a small white circle. Okay, like this. Let's take this size and I'm going to put the white dot like this. Okay, after this, let's fill the color inside the fins. For that, again, I'm going to take the calligraphy brush, take the last size, and let's take the orange color. You can use the magnifier to be more precise. Click on the brush tool again, and then try to fill the color properly. Like this. By using the magnifier, it will be easier for you to fill the color. So this way I am going to fill the color in all of the fins. So this way I have filled the color in all the fins. Now to again zoom out, either you go to view and zoom out or you can move from here. You can zoom out from here. You can see it is 200% right now. And this is how you can zoom out. Again, now I am going to take another brush, the crayon. And let me take the red color. Let me take second size. And this way I am going to make some spots over here like this. Okay. and then take your calligraphy brush and of course you have to reduce the size take the second size and just make some scales like this if you make, can make them a little bit circular in shape
like this and with the crayon you can reduce the size you can also give an effect like this Now for making the grass, again I am going to click on the calligraphy brush and I will take the last size, take the green color and draw the grass like this. You can make it circular like this and uh, you can also take a lighter color to add more right like this and now how to make the bubbles for making the bubbles again I am going to take the oval tool and let's take watercolor this time choose white color in color 1 and color 2 okay click on color 1 take white color similarly click on color 2 take white color and then draw the drops make one bigger then when you are going up make them smaller as you go up like this So this way you can make the drops, water drops. You can make some here as well. And then if you want to write your name, I recommend to use the calligraphy brush. Take the black color, click on color 1, take black color and then write whatever you want to write with the calligraphy brush. So you can write your name as well. It is very satisfying to use the calligraphy brush for writing. I just love it. Let me see, do you love it? Write me in the comment section if you love the painting using calligraphy brush. And if you have any doubt, you can write in the comment section. Do enjoy growing and keep learning, keep exploring. Be awesome and subscribe.